Hello, and thank you very much for taking a look at our business plan specific for a crepe restaurant. Um, very quickly, I'm going to walk you through the Excel model, and then I'll show you the business plan itself. Um, certainly, there are a num number of other um, documents that come along with it, which I'll discuss at the end of this video. Um, here you enter in the amount of capital that you're looking to raise, and the, for the purposes of the template, um, we have it set as a bank loan for $100,000. Again, you can adjust or modify any of this uh, specific for your needs. Here you break down uh, the amount of money you're looking to raise, and you can structure this for an investor as well. From there, you enter in your revenue streams, and here we have food and beverage products. You can adjust any of these titles, and you can add revenue streams as needed. Um, here you have your personnel, and again, you can change the titles, you can change your salaries. Throughout this document, there are a number of notations, as you can see here, to let you know exactly how to use it, uh, rather than flipping back and forth with an instruction uh, manual, which is included. Here you put in your underlying yearly expenses. From there, you go to the monthly sales tab, and you simply enter in um, your anticipated month-to-month uh, -month revenue for the first year, and you can change this very easily. I have it set as a formula at the moment, but you can adjust this manually if you'd like. From there, you enter in your yearly growth rate, and once you do that, out comes a profit and loss statement for a three-year period. Oops. For the first year, this is broken down monthly, and this is done uh, automatically. In year two, it's quarterly. In year three, it's quarterly. The cash flow analysis, uh, and again, there are notations what you can and cannot edit throughout this. Much like the profit and loss statement, um, this is broken down monthly for year one, quarterly for year two, and quarterly for year three. Your break-even analysis, business ratios, balance sheet, and if you want to modify the headcount, you go to personnel monthly. Um, again, this follows the progression of the, how you should edit this, um, and you can adjust this here. Let me just go and pull up the Word document now. And this is a business plan that is completely specific for a crepe restaurant. It features an automated table of content, so as you add content, simply hit Update Field and OK, um, and these would automatically update for you. It starts with the executive summary, outlining the sweet and savory crepes that you'll be providing. And as you can see, the charts and graphs from the Excel model seamlessly transfer here, and there's instructions on how to do that. The breakdown of the funds that you're raising an overview of the crepe restaurant and operations. The market analysis, which is updated for this year and discusses COVID-19. The marketing plan. Uh, and there is a standalone 24-page marketing plan that comes along with it, and that's in Word as well. An overview of your organization, headcount and personnel, and, uh, excuse me, payroll. And of course, the financial plan, uh, which again, as you can see, has the three-year profit and loss statement, cash flow analysis, balance sheet, break-even analysis, and business ratios. And the last two appendices, and, and I'll spare you the headache, are just those uh, expanded profit and loss and cash flow analysis statements that you saw in the Excel model. And that's essentially it. It's a very easy to use uh, program. They're coming with it uh, beyond these two documents. Again, is the 24-page standalone marketing plan pitch deck, three SWOT analysis templates, uh, as well as a number of other uh, documents that will help you in writing a business plan specific for your crepe restaurant. Thank you very much for taking a look. If you have any questions, you can reach us on the live chat. Uh, it's in the bottom corner um, or through our contact us page. Take care.